In this video, we will showcase 40 Client EMS as an effective solution for Chromebook compliancy and enforcement in the education sector. Here is the high level topology of how Chromebooks are typically deployed in a campus. At the bottom, we have the campus network, where we have the students' Chromebooks, the 40 gate next generation firewall, along with the 40 client EMS and the 40 analyzer in the data center. When it comes to Chromebooks, students are often allowed to take them off campus. As such, 40 client EMS allows for either on-prem or off-prem management of Chromebooks at all times, as seen here. 40 Client EMS integrates with Google G Suite for Education for web filtering policy enforcement over the entire campus organizational unit as defined in G Suite. Along with the 40 Client EMS and the 40 Gate Next Generation Firewall, the 40 Analyzer is an integral part of the security fabric and enables effective management of Chromebook's web filtering policies as well as logging and reporting. For this demo, we will focus on the 40 Client EMS, the 40 Analyzer, the G Suite Administrator Console, and the Chromebook. Let's start with the 40 Client EMS. 40 Client EMS is a full-featured endpoint management solution that has Chromebook integration built in, along with a dedicated dashboard as seen here. This dashboard provides a high-level snapshot of the current state of the environment, including top web filtering violations, top violating students, as well as active users. From here, we are able to drill into the specifics. Let's have a look at all the students that have visited gambling websites. We can see a couple of students that have been attempting to visit some gambling sites. Johnny is one of them. Here, we are able to see the timestamp of Johnny's attempted visit, the organizational unit he belongs to, the site category, as well as whether his access was allowed or blocked. Now, let's go back and look further. IT administrators primarily use G Suite's admin console as the way to manage all Chromebooks, the students, and the school's overall organizational structure. Within the console, we can see the list of the students here. We can also expand the organizational unit to look at subgroups and the students assigned within them. Here, we see that Johnny is part of the middle school subgroup within the school's OU. The 40 client EMS integrates closely with G Suite for Education by utilizing Google's APIs. Within the Google Domains list in 40 Client EMS, we can see the exact same list of students we saw earlier in the G Suite Admin Console, as well as the same structure of their organizational units. Just as we saw earlier, we see that Johnny is in the middle school subgroup. This list shows us the student's email address, their last login date, and the last date that their associated Chromebook retrieved for the client EMS policies. By clicking on Johnny's name, we can dive deeper and look into the last 30 days of his activities. Shown here is an overview of all of Johnny's blocked sites visits, the top 10 categories of the sites visited, and the detail of every site he has visited in the past 30 days. Going back, each of the organizational units we have here, including elementary school, middle school, and high school, can have unique and specific profiles assigned to them. In the Endpoint Profiles section, there is a dedicated section for Chromebook profiles. As seen here, we have defined separate profiles for each of the subgroup school sections. Let's have a look at the settings of the profile for middle school, where Johnny is located. Starting from the top, 
where we first enable the web filtering capability. Following that, we have general settings. This is where we select what items are to be logged, as well as enable safe search enforcement. The highlight section here is the web filter site categories. Fortinet's web filtering system contains over 75 URL categories that is constantly updated and maintained by Fortinet's FortiGuard security division. There are more than 43 million rated websites and over 2 billion web pages. For each of the categories and subcategories, there are four different actions that can be applied. Block, Warn, Allow, or Monitor. For middle school, the block policy is applied for adult content. At the bottom, we have the exclusions list. This provides the ability to define blacklists and whitelists. URLs can be defined in terms of simple URLs, wildcards, or using regular expression for complicated URLs. The System Settings tab is where logging is configured. Forty Client EMS integrates with Forty Analyzer and Forty Manager for enhanced and long-term logging and reporting. Here, the desired log levels can be set, along with the log upload schedule and the retention length. Now, let's go to Johnny's Chromebook. As Johnny logs into his Chromebook and opens his browser, we can see that the Forty Client extension is pre-installed and it is enforced by the administrator, preventing Johnny from being able to remove it, as defined in the G Suite domain policy. When Johnny attempts to go to a gambling website, the Forty Client extension immediately blocks it and shows a site blocked message. The message provides the URL that was attempted, the category it's in, and the reason it was blocked. After repeated attempts of accessing undesirable websites, a school administrator may want to know more about Johnny's activities. To help with this, let's go to the 40 Analyzer. 40 Analyzer is a powerful logging and reporting tool that's integrated with the 40 Client EMS and is an essential part of the security fabric. Here, 40 View provides different top-level overviews of all activities with the ability to drill down into a specific category. When we look at the gambling category, we can see all of Johnny's recent attempts at accessing the gambling site. The top websites view shows us a granular view of the most visited websites. Another way to view the data is by going to the log view. Within the log view, we can select a specific amount of time we want to go back and use its powerful filtering and search capabilities to get specific data. In this case, the school administrator may want to see all the sites that Johnny has visited that have been blocked in the last seven days as such. This data can then be downloaded as text or CSV format as required. The school administrator may want to see this report on a regular basis, in which case a custom view can be created and saved easily that pulls up the latest instance of the same report available instantly. This view is always available with the latest results. Lastly, the 40 Analyzer provides a powerful way to create reports. Here, we have several custom reports that have been created. One of the reports we have is the web usage by user. This will give us a report of the top websites visited and the student that visited it the most. Running this report job instantly generates the report with availability in different formats, including PDF. 
Looking at the report, we can see a list of the top websites sorted in the order visited and the student that visited them the most. Fortinet Security Fabric, including FortiClient EMS and the Forti Analyzer, provides a comprehensive solution for endpoint compliance and enforcement of Chromebooks in the education sector.